Hey everybody, how's it going? Today let's take a look at the 2020 BMW M340i. And this is going to be a full in-depth tour. We'll start it up, go through some of the features of the exterior and interior, as well as some of the performance data. And today I'm at Birchwood BMW in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. And so, without further ado, let's go and start her up, let her run. And of course, this vehicle does come with the proximity sensors, so when you lock the vehicle, basically, this has a walk away and approach um, detector. So, when I walk close to the vehicle, well, it does have the standard remote keyless access. So right now it's unlocked and with four with the four door handles you're able to lock and lock the vehicle with the rear pattern as well as touch sensors behind. Tap the ridge, locks it and folds the mirrors in with one chime, then after waiting a second just grab onto any of the door handles. And that unlocks it. Now of course too the vehicle does come with like a walk away detection system, so when you walk away from the vehicle, let's see if it picks up a bit so when you walk away from the vehicle, it will lock the vehicle automatically, and then when you walk close to it, the car will sense the key fob, and it unlocks the vehicle. It's the mineral white metallic, with red perforated leather, as well as black, so it's a two-toned black and red leather. And of course you got your black veneer. And of course you got push button ignition, put your foot on the brake. If they send a console mount a button to go. Beautiful. And of course you got a three spoke leather wrapped steering wheel, nice tight grip feedback, bolstering, leather stitched with your leather stitched airbag cover, aluminum, as well as your M badging down there. And of course you got a neat speed automatic, put your foot on the brake, hit the unlock, pull down to drive, click it on over for manual or sport mode. And of course you got your S gear as well. You also got the paddle shifters on the steering wheel as well to manually shift the vehicle. Up once for neutral and then all the way up for reverse. You also got your rear view camera as well as guidance lines as well as parking lines when you turn the wheel and then just hit P for park. All in a nice standardized shift boot. So let's go and turn on the headlamps. They're also automatic. Fog lamps. I suppose the front and rear parking lamps. Hazards. Naturally all four windows are fully automatic with laminated glass. Let's go and check out the exterior, shall we? And of course the vehicle will chime letting you know it's lost detection of the key fob. BMW M30i has been refreshed for a bit of the 2020 model year, so it's not really the M3 that's come out yet, but this is sort of like the 340i variant. But all in all, this is the, you know, base model M Sport. So you got the all new LED light system with Corona headlamp rings, front park and assist, as well as lower air intake for that dynamics, lower front spoiler, and of course your new kidney grill from BMW. LED turn signals, fog lamps, and it's also laser light technology so it shines lighter as well as farther away. So brighter and farther away. You also got your LED parking lamps, side park assist, as well as 20 inch aluminum alloy wheels with those M performance as well as M performance brakes on Bridgestone summer tires. M logo, lower dished out area for aerodynamics as well as your swooping lines, rain sensing wipers, powerful link steer mirrors with LED turn signals, they're also heated with blind spot as well as your camera for your 360 degrees. Side spoiler, also got a full panoramic sunroof, wireless antenna, as well as your rear LED tail lamps, dual quad exhaust, sport exhaust system, rear park assist, 
LED license plate lights as well as your rear view camera. You also got your X Drive all wheel drive through BMW rear park assist as well as your side park assist as well as well as like a little air intake sort of like your so rear spoiler for the back as well. Speaking of that, you also got a bit of a spoiler that comes up into a point. And just looking at those rear tail lamps, very nice, very illuminated. And of course you got your leather lined, so with BMW, no exception, with of course quality materials. So you got leather, padded materials, aluminum, storage, trunk release, water bottle holder, power folding steer mirrors, and of course two person memory, lock and unlock, rear window lock, M340i entry guard, all with a floor mat, sport pedals, as well as a 21 or 12 way power adjustable seat, honeycomb stitching, Let's go and see how she sounds, shall we? And of course too, you got your Sport Comfort Eco Pro as well as auto hold function. So you can hold the vehicle in a gear, electronic parking brake, Pull up to activate and then put your front of the brake, push down to deactivate. Parking sensors, camera system, turn off your traction control as well as your auto start stop feature. You also got your um, adaptive drive, so you got sport, comfort, as well as eco pro mode. And of course, when you put it into sport plus, it automatically gives the higher pitch of the exhaust. And of course, press and hold and you turn off your DSC. So let's go and shut her up. Nice solid feel. And of course you got your little bit of storage there. And of course this BMW does feature the standard Harman Kardon surround sound system. In the near future, I will be transitioning from tap water to using a jug of Side curtain water. airbags, Bluetooth Come connect. On. Uh, Bluetooth telephone or speaker for your Bluetooth telephone card holder. And although not a single soul will notice or probably care, I'll have three car garage home link with your auto dimming your view mirror. Quality water. Illumination. <laughs> all LED lit. And of course, one touch automatic sunroof. Well, for the visor. And then, of course, you got a wind deflector that pops up. But <laughs> that is it for me. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday evening. I will be back on air tomorrow at noon. And as always, and of course, you also got like a little vent feature. And blitz out. You also got SOS through BMW as well as your speakers. Or for your, sorry, your microphone for your Bluetooth, as well as a bit of LED illumination. So it's your main home screen. So you got media, Bluetooth. Um, so you got your standard radio, Sirius XM satellite, AM, FM radio, Spotify. You also got. Enjoy sound settings go to pizzahotline.ca to download the flyer and order your prepackaged communication so bluetooth now. apple carplay android you auto navigation cancer care manitoba settings challenge for life is virtual august 1st to 20th you can also change the way your map looks points of interest patterson global foods it's blue and white, and it tastes like a tropical vacation. Figure services, roof preferences, updates, so on and so forth, contacts, GPS coordinates. We also got car settings, so driving information, vehicle status. And then, of course, you got your carrying car, driver profiles, owner's manual, settings for your vehicle, as well as ambient lighting. And of course, you got your apps as well for like internet based connectivity. And of course, you got your climate control down here. And you also got your 
intelligence safety as well. A message from Canadian Blood Service. So you got heat seats, max front defrost, redefrost, auto temperature adjustment, different zones, fan speed, and of course you got your recycling. There are lots of reasons to donate blood. Book now at blood.ca. So you got your air circulation automatic as well. Menu AC, max AC, as well as heated seats for both the passenger and you also got the passengers different uh, adjusting for um, climate control. You also got your mode band, so like preset stations, tuned seat, wireless phone charging tray, 12 volt power outlet, USB as well as cup holders. You also got turn off traction control. You can also use a camera system, parking, parking uh, sensors. You also got settings as well. You can also change the way the camera looks as well, I believe. So you can change the change the camera systems, I believe, camera image. And of course you got your auto start stop feature to turn off. You also got your different modes, comfort, eco pro, sport, sport plus, auto hold. And of course you got a center console with um, illumination as well as USB Type-C connector. All leather stitched. Very nice. And of course you got your heads up display with your current speed limit. So you got your speed limit, current uh, kilometer that you're at, as well as your uh, tachometer, or your, not tachometer, your uh, RPM. And of course you got your storage, like I think I mentioned earlier. And of course you got your turn signal stock. Intermittent wipers, cruise control settings, as well as your media inputs, volume, as well as voice commands. Help. Please select a category, for example, navigation. Cancel. So ideally, you can hit the button, it'll cancel, and it's simple to use voice command, it walks you through everything with the system. And of course, all like that. Simple to use as well. So you can also go on the system and you have the lock and unlock when you approach the vehicle. Alrighty. So let's go and shut her down. And of course too, that system too, the sound system is super nice. Just that Harman card. Beautiful. Alrighty, now let's go and shut her down. Let's go and check out the back seat. And of course, too, you also got your heated steering wheel, and of course, your big Harman Kardon uh, center speaker. So, rear passengers treated with a sumptuous amount of luxury storage, water bottle holder, window release. You also got rear storage net in the back, climate control vent or air vents, climate control, two USB Type C connectors, 12 volt power outlet, armrest with two cup holders. And you also got a trunk pass through as well to fit longer items in the back. You also got rear illumination as well, as well as coat hooks on the roof. And you also got your speakers in the back. And of course, you also got your Harman Kardon speakers as well as your child anchors for the back as well. Let's go and check out the rest of the vehicle. So, trunk release, powered, quick and easy opening, large amounts of cargo room. Like I said, you can fold down the rear, so you can also fold down the rear seats. You also got a storage net in the back as well. Both, uh, well, you got a storage net in the back. So you got a storage net here in the well, storage net on the storage net on the back, 12 volt power outlet, and a bit of storage bin on the side. 
Actually, you got two storage nets. So a storage net and a storage bin. So there you go. So you got two storage nets as well as a bin on the side. You also got tie down hooks on the two tie down hooks on the back on the back there. And of course you got your spare tire underneath as well as your fuse box uh, entrance as well. You also got a bit got a bit of a brushed guard there. And of course, hit the button. Apparently it won't work, but if you want, use the hands-free access, kick underneath. You can also hit the button as well to close the tailgate. Simple as that. Fuel filler cap. You also got the same thing as the rear passenger. And of course, you also got the same thing as the driver, just without that two-person memory. Lock the glove box, lined in felt, illuminated. It also doubles as a cool box to keep items chilled from the AC. And of course, And of course, you also got gesture control, I forgot to mention. So you can use... So you can control the volume, next station, and of course, decline a call, accept a call, and of course, you can use it all hands-free. Beautiful vehicle. Well built with, of course, luxury as well as BMW and performance. Definitely a head turner anywhere you go. Well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed the in-depth tour of the 2020 BMW M340i. Be sure to stay tuned next time. There's a lot more where that came from. Take care, everybody.